this is this is clearly a copy and paste. Clearly. Are you kidding me? Look at that. So this guy literally used this other gentleman's name, his name and likeness, and his photo in his LinkedIn profile. What's going on? It's Sean. We're back at it again. And in today's video, it's going to get a little spicy. We're going to jump into the LinkedIn DMs. Here we go! If you are finding my channel for the first time, we're all about self-help and entrepreneurship. So if that's something that interests you, make sure you like this video and consider subscribing. Do it! And with that out of the way, let's jump right into it. Ah, uh, LinkedIn, LinkedIn. You are the driest social platform out there and you really are trying your best to flex and be like Instagram and Twitter and Snapchat and everything else all in one. And I gotta give you props, you've definitely come a long way since I signed up in about 2011. And let's be honest, not very many people use it and honestly, it's probably a bad thing because according to Gary Vee, there is so much organic reach that you really can capture on there and unfortunately, it just isn't hip right now and maybe things will change and I know people have really actually built their influence through LinkedIn like Lewis Howes if any are you if any of you are familiar with him he has a very big podcast and he really started out as like a LinkedIn master so although I'm going to so although these DMs are going to be a little cringy and we're going to get into it in a second. Um, I really think there is untapped potential of LinkedIn. And I thought this would be a very cool way to go on my LinkedIn, check and see what's going on. But more importantly, see what's uh, what's up in the DMs. Now, the bad side of LinkedIn is it's full of people just bragging about all their accomplishments that they've made. And it really just does seem like a more professional version of Facebook. Again, just bragging about business accomplishments and posting about you know their political views at least recently that's all i've seen because the election just happened and worst of all it's just all about people just trying to sell you something or sell you on their product or service and speaking of that let's jump into the pitches i, I mean i mean the dms let's get into it all right where do i want to start i think that i'm going to start closer to the bottom and work my way up to the most recent because if this video is a good one, maybe I'll do a second and a third part because I literally never answer my LinkedIn DMs. I don't even open them anymore because they're all the same. But just to show you in case you're not hip to it, uh, we're gonna go through a lot of the same things, I'm sure. So I'm gonna start at the bottom and work and work my way up and we'll see how this thing goes. Wow, I'm just like, Scrolling down, scrolling down. The only ones that I've opened have been uh, the ones that I've done by accident where I didn't mean to open them. Um, or maybe that they, they did really catch my eye and you know entice me and then I'm like, okay, this is just a friggin' pitch. So I didn't answer. We're going all the way back to, ah, here we go. Wow, almost a year ago to the day, 126.20. Donald says, Hello, Sean. Thank you for accepting my invitation to connect. I want to introduce you to Surge Resources and find out if we may be able to save you time and money. Next. Niha says, Hi, Sean. Thanks for your acceptance. Please allow me to introduce myself in detail. I am part of an esteemed organization providing successful website and mobile apps mobile apps development with SEO, SMO, and PPC services. We provide pre-screened, referenced, and available expertise to mission-critical projects. All right, that wasn't so bad. I guess she was just really telling me what she does. She wasn't really saying, you know, you know, how can I help you? Uh, Suzanne says, Hi, Sean. Great to connect. How are you today? That was nice. I feel bad not responding. Hinal says, Hi, Sean. I would love to join your network and welcome you to mine. I wanted to reach out and see if I can help you with data. We are experts in web scraping, data mining, data analytics, lead generation, data processing, automation, crawler, bot, and internet search. Warm regards. Warm regards. Warm regards and all. Uh, yeah, again, just trying to sell me something. Jameson Payne. 
<laughs> You're gonna put me in so much pain, aren't you, Jameson? Hi, Sean. I'm a national team director at Keller Williams Commercial. If we could ever be assistance to you, if we can ever be of assistance to address any of your team's commercial real estate needs, please let me know. Thank you, Jamie. Not so bad. Very, very soft with the introduction. You know, saying hello, but obviously, you know, there's an ulterior motive there. Vera says, what's up? And he's a very emo looking uh, person. Not that there's anything wrong with that. Uh, his title is Life Coach Teaching at the Fabric of the Universe. Hashtag electrons. <laughs> Uh, law of Attraction. I love it. I love it. I'm making a Law of Attraction video uh, that'll be coming out soon, so make sure you guys are um, looking out for it. So make sure you got those post notifications turned on so you won't miss a thing. Sarah says, Hello, my name is Sarah and I'm founder of a nonprofit named Undivided. We are dedicated to transforming our communities by equipping, encouraging, and empowering students to engage with one another in a way that creates change on their campuses and communities. Okay, so she's looking for a sponsor there. You know, again, it's it's a pitch. It's a non-profit, but you still want my money. Next, Daniel says, Okay. <laughs> this guy used Daniel Ezra. And if I'm not mistaken, this is... It is. It is. It is. Are you, are you kidding me? Look at that. So this guy literally used this other gentleman's name, Daniel Ezra, he's the lead actor on All of America, All of American, on All American, if you don't know what that show is, it's about these high school football players, it's on, I think, uh, WB, I don't know, I watched it on Netflix, it's a pretty good show, actually, but this man, or this person, has used Daniel Ezra's name and likeness and his photo in his LinkedIn profile, and he's trying to sell me SEO techniques. Why? What are you doing? Khalil says, okay, he sent two messages, one on the 12th of February 2020, one on, the, one on February 13th. Okay, so he sent me a pre-connect message to say what's up, and then he says, thank you for connecting. I would love to learn more about your business model and your role in driving business. We are experts in business evolution. We help businesses and businesses units thrive in an ever-changing and deeply connected world. We manage and execute digital marketing for our clients helping to increase their digital footprint and brand value. Are you open to jumping on a discovery call? All right, Jackie Clayton. I see we have some mutual connection, so if I can be any assistant connecting you with anyone, please feel free to reach out. Okay, starting off with the value, giving me value, I like that. We like that value first. I don't intend to hard sell anyone or close them. That isn't how we do business at a client connection marketing. We take good care of professionals and business owners with highly competitive prices on digital and internet marketing services for high quality work in return. If there's anything I can help you with, again, please give me a shout as I'm more than willing for you just to pick up, pick my brain if there's anything you need to know regarding your digital marketing. I, I even can audit your social media to help you p patch up some weak spots. Wishing you a great day and can you discuss in the new year. Kind regards, Jackie Clayton. I actually, I liked how we led with value that automatically brought down my wall of what are you, like what are you trying to sell me what's what's your ulterior motive here evo says welcome to my network sean it's a pleasure to have you as a connection i hope to get to know you thanks second message now my company offering a 21 days free trial service to your company so if you can try and see how effective our facebook advertising when it's managed by certified adv advertisers when can we schedule a call to talk about more details okay evo cutting straight through the bullshit i can honestly respect that as well as much as i've been saying i don't like all the pitches i can appreciate when someone isn't, you know, giving me the huge paragraph saying, Thank you for connecting. It's an honor. You're the best person I've ever seen in my life. I really just want to get to know you. You just seem like a really nice guy. Tell me more about your business. And then hits me with the hard sell, hard pass. So some of these are actually like confusing my brain because again, I mean, there's obviously a language barrier with some of these, these folks. And it's, it's kind of funny, like, reading them out loud and, like, seeing the errors. Husnain says... Oh, that confused me. Hello, Rick. Have you ever... <laughs> this 
this is this is clearly a copy and paste. Clearly. Hello, Rick. Have you have you ever been looking for someone to be your virtual assistant for data entry, web research, and other tasks? Please check my profile. Thanks, Sean. Your name is Husnain. You copy and pasted this. You meant to send this to Rick, or you sent this to Rick, copied it from Rick, meant to send it to me, and you misplaced my name in the copy and paste. Classic. Classic. And we'll end it on this one because this video is already well over 15 minutes. And I think that if you guys like this, just smash the like button and I will definitely do a part two to this and maybe even a part three because I'm telling you, I got a year's worth of DMs and LinkedIn to get through. And I'm not opening them unless it's with you. Let's do this. Last one, Gabe Peterson. Hey Sean, I run a real estate marketing firm and real estate investing business and saw we shared real estate in common. So I thought it would be good to connect. Dude, that was very, that was awesome. That was awesome. He's a real estate investor, podcast host, and um, you know, maybe if I had responded, he may have tried to see, you know, if I needed anything, but doesn't seem that way. Very straightforward, I appreciated that. So that was some of the uh, spicy LinkedIn DMs. If you're going to pitch someone, again, as that other gentleman, I forget his name already, I think it was Jack, lead with value. Give, 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 then ask. Or as Gary Vee likes to say, jab, 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 right hook. You always wanna offer something and provide value to someone before you ask. Much like these YouTube videos, I try to remind you guys to like and subscribe and do all that good stuff, but I always try to provide value for free on these YouTube videos. So again, um, like the video, subscribe uh, if you enjoyed it, and uh, make sure you turn on post notifications because if this gets enough likes and I'm going to set the like goal at 1,000, I'm going to do a part two. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I'll catch you next time. Signing off.